Smyrna Cowboy rides again. Hello everybody, Smyrna Cowboy here on a Thursday. I don't know what uh, day of the month it is. It's 11.49 in the morning, getting ready to be lunchtime. But uh, I'm out here doing a little vlogging. Just got through uh, visiting my friend's house. Going out to my brother's house now to uh, see what he's up to today. But uh, while I was riding, I thought I would do a response to uh, David Howell in Canada. He offered a couple of, uh, three actually, vlogger questions. I love answering these because I'd rather do them on video. Of course, that gives me a topic and uh, gives me something to talk about. Like I didn't need nothing else to talk about. But uh, uh, I like to thank everyone for the concern and the well wishes from my uh, kidney stones video and yeah that sucker really hurt and uh, I want to thank everybody for that I would like to answer each and every one of them but I don't I don't know if uh, you guys have been having trouble with as far as YouTube replying to each one and then when you get to the video itself it does all your answers and you know one right after the other and stuff you have to go to see all comments and then it's put in put in uh, order like that so that's what I'm having to do well anyway let me get to the questions here all right David Howe of course there's my cheat sheet gotta have it uh, do you use two fingers when you break uh, no actually I don't I use three uh, as you can see on this left hand I have three and the uh, two fingers here are cupped like that and also on the uh, throttle side so I just use uh, I use three fingers because uh, I've been looking through forms and everything in the best way because I've been having problems with my hands becoming numb and to uh, hold this rider you hold the handlebars lightly like you're holding an egg you still have control of the bike but you don't put a death grip on the hand grips themselves and it alleviates all the numbness that you get when you're riding so that might be a little a little tip for you so I use three fingers on each uh, brake you know as far as scooters go your brakes are on your handlebars now for a motorcycle you know you have your clutch and your front brake on your handlebars and you use your right foot for your brake on a motorcycle but for uh, us scooter riders I just use three fingers on this side and three fingers on the other. Do you cover your brakes? That's question number two. Do you cover your brakes? I do the, the left one because that gives me more control in the curves and everything when I go into the curve. Now I don't cover the right brake unless there is a hazard ahead. I see somebody in an intersection or see somebody uh, turning their brake on to turn left in front of you. Uh, then I cover both brakes and and uh, reduce my speed just a little bit to see exactly what these guys are going to do. Even though I have my dorky yellow safety vest on and my headlight modulators on and they still don't see. I had an incident this morning. I'm going to go see my daughter. She works at uh, the hospital here in Smyrna and going to the parking lot and you know in between the parking spaces had the right of way and this young girl still had her graduation tassel in her rear view mirror talking on a cell phone just pulls right out in front of me and she stopped at the uh, stop sign there but she just pulls right out in front of me so I beat my horn looking straight at me and it still kept coming so I had to I wasn't going very fast at all maybe I don't know 10 miles an hour if that if that much and uh, had to put on my brakes hard and I looked at her square in the eye and her saying she's sorry and she keeps on driving off and you just want to you know you just want to pull your helmet off and give them what for but you know there's no sense of getting myself tore up because of that just shake it off nod your head and shake it and say well what a dummy you know 
So that's uh, question number two. Do you cover your brakes? Number three, at a stoplight, one foot or both feet when you come to a stop? Well, for me, it's easier with both feet because I can swing them both up at the same time when I start off. So uh, for me, it's, uh, it's both feet at a stoplight. It's just, uh, I've just been doing it for so long and it's just easier for me to do that. So in answer to your question, Dave, it's, uh, it's both feet on there. So I thought I'd uh, answer those questions if uh, anybody else wants to do this challenge or, or tag or whatever you want to call it. Please be feel, <laughs> feel free to do so. There we go. Now I'm speaking plain, aren't I? <laughs> Well, I guess that's about it for this video, so I'm going to wrap it up here. This is a Smyrna Cowboy going to my brother's house in Smyrna, Tennessee, getting ready to pass the lake, J. Percy Priest Reservoir. Boy, it already passed it. <laughs> Wishing you and yours a good day. And until next time, as I always say in all my videos, adios.